Alrighty, so let's take a look at this NOCO uh, Genius One. It's going to be the car battery trickle charger. So let's just kind of open this up a bit. Um, actually, I had already removed the plastic, just so you know. Here is the owner's manual. I will definitely need to read this to make sure I use this well. There are a lot of um, uh, reviews on Amazon saying, hey, this didn't work, um, but I think it's, I think you're supposed to, uh, you know, pick the right setting in order to make sure that it works best for you. So I'm just going to open this up. Um, go. It's a pretty small little unit. Um, some more accessories and stuff. And let's just take this out. So it looks like this is going to plug straight into the wall. And we've got the wiring back here. Okay, so looks like this is kind of a quick connect or disconnect, and looks like this is going to connect to the batteries right away. So before I connect it to the the car, I definitely want to read the owner's manual. What my intention to use this uh, this product is to have a trickle charge so that the battery doesn't run out and if the battery gets then recharged for the unit to turn off. Um, so uh, the car is going to be uh, in storage for uh, weeks at a time. So I need to be able to uh, uh, get to it whenever I need to. It looks like, okay, this is kind of cool. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, let's see here, that looks like a fuse, and looks like it would just connect here. So one side is hex, the other one is round, so it'll, or pentagon, uh, so it'll attach like that. That's cool. And then I guess I can detach it, open this up, and then detach it. Okay, cool. So... Uh, next step is to read this guy. All right, so I've been reading this guy, and it looks like the only times that I really need to press and hold this mode button, this is a mode button here, um, is when I want to do something fancy, like do the 12 volt lithium uh, or the 6 volt. Um, so so it doesn't look like I need to do anything if I need to be in this 12 volt, volt mode. Um, so I'm actually gonna hook it up and see how it works. Um, the one thing that I was concerned about was um, how well I know when it is in maintenance mode. And it looks like um, uh, when you when I come to this other page um, here maintenance green LED uh, um, it'll tell me that the battery is fully charged and then it'll go into green the LED will go into green mode and it says here the charger can be left connected to the battery indefinitely and that's what I was looking for so I'm gonna connect it to the car to the car battery and then um, see if it needs to charge, most likely it will have to charge the battery a little bit, uh, but let's see where we're at. All right, so I've got it connected um, and just want to show you it's really easy to set up after reading the instructions. So first things first, uh, we need to connect the, the alligator clips to the terminals. Okay, so that needs to connect first and then um, this is attached, you can quickly detach it if you need to, instead of unplugging it from the wall. So that's pretty handy. And 
Uh, it's already plugged into the wall, but I'm going to unplug it and just show you how easy it is to set up. So it's a little cramped here, so sorry about that. Um, so right now it's red, which means that it's charging and it's kind of like this slow beat red. And you see this light here that's on, that's 12 volts. So I'm going to unplug it, okay? So as you see, nothing's on here. Let's plug it back in. Hold on a second here. There we go, plugged it back in. And um, actually let's, let's unplug it again because it actually s stayed in the same setting. I wanted to actually show you what it was like. So let me just kind of unplug it and let's plug it back in. Let me try the lower one. There we go, that was easier. And all the lights turn on, it's green. Um, and we're on, we're on 12 volt. Um, you know, I could have changed it to, to any of these, but uh, pressing the mode button, you get to 12 right there. And then you see that it's, and you see that it's at, um, it's charging. The light, that red LED light slowly turns on and off and it's on 12 volt, all right? And when it's fully charged, it'll stay on green, which means it's just on maintenance mode. So uh, pretty good, pretty easy to set up. Um, for a car battery, all you really need is this. So that's it, you guys. Um, let's see what happens uh, once it's fully charged up. Alrighty, so moment of truth. I uh, removed the charging cables uh, from the battery and now we're gonna start the car. That's great. That's fantastic. Um, I left it on overnight and it'll just do a trickle charge once it, uh, you know, fully charges the battery, but it works folks. I totally recommend the product if your car is sitting in the garage and you, um, you know, don't start it up, you can't, you can't get to it. Uh, if you want a little trickle battery charge on it, I think this is the way to go. All right, you guys, thanks a lot. Please put your comments, suggestions uh, below, and thanks for watching.